The title of the book we will review in this video is entitled The Night of the New Moon by Sir Lawrence John Vanderpost, aka Lawrence Vanderpost. Short info about Sir Vanderpost for you guys. He was a 20th century Afrikaner author of many books. In 1958, his best known book was published under the same title as the BBC series The Lost World of the Kalahari. He was also a farmer, political advisor to British heads of government, close friend of Prince Charles, godfather of Prince William, educator, journalist, humanitarian, philosopher, explorer, and a war hero. If you guys want to know more about Sir Pander Post, I will leave a link down below for some resources that might help you get some details about his life. Actually, this book was his bibliography about the remarkable story of his experiences in the prison of the war camp in Java. When the atomic bombings on Hiroshima and Nagasaki in Japan happened during 1945. First record of the doom of Nagasaki, target for atom bomb number two, is filmed from a super fortress many miles away. I am really excited to show to you guys the book that I bought a few months ago from an online store. This is a pre-loved book, meaning it was once used by a reader. Yes, it is cheaper and can be seen some proof of usage, but what I love about it is the value of the book. So here it is guys, I got it without a dust jacket, but I've done some research about the book and found out that the dust jacket looks like this. Gorgeous, right? So how are they to know when we met? I felt my love. So let's take a look inside the book. This is the contents. When I read the illustration, the prologue, to the entire story, I noticed that Sir Vanderpost used the first person point of view. I found it interesting because it feels like I am definitely in the same shoes as him. It gives his narrating an exciting thrill to the whole story. I will give a more detailed look of the book to show to all of you. to his adventure-like encounter to the soldiers, prisoners, government as well, because it was the event of war. It also mentioned the other countries like Korea.
detailed contents, like the exact date of each day Sir Vanderpost passed over. Also, really love the plate indicated for some illustrations. And that's it. I decided to create a video about this book because this is the first bibliography book I purchased. And lastly, I really want to exhibit the work of Sir Vanderpost, including its literature and arts. And yeah, that's the end guys. I really hope you learned something. And see you next time. Bye!